Meet the XV-70 Valkyrie, one of the most extreme aircraft the United States ever built. It was a six-engine bomber that could fly at Mach 3 at 70,000 feet. The idea was simple, fly faster and higher than any enemy could reach. Its folding wingtips created compression lift. That means the aircraft used shockwaves to gain free lift at high speed. This saved fuel and boosted range. The engines produced 172,000 pounds of thrust. The heat during flight was so intense that the aircraft used stainless steel and titanium throughout its skin. It could carry a B-52-sized payload but fly three times faster. But the world changed. Surface-to-air missiles became strong enough to reach high-altitude bombers. At the same time, intercontinental missiles became the main nuclear weapon. Then, a mid-air collision in 1966 destroyed one of the prototypes. The program ended soon after. Even though it never entered service, the XB-70 gave engineers valuable research for the SR-71, the B-1, and modern high-temperature aircraft design. Only one Valkyrie survives today a reminder of a time when engineers tried to outrun the future itself.